What's up, YouTube? Okay, got a new team for tonight's uh, Wi-Fi battles and uh, throughout this week. All right, so um, I've been looking forward to use this team. It's a mix of some decent pokes um, and some rather really ones you'd never see. So it was a good little mix-up, and I'm, I'm going to give this team a go. Now, our question of the day from the last video. What was the most commonly... Um, Common move throughout uh, all Pokemon, and the answer was uh, Hidden Power. Now, for today's question, let's think. Okay, what is the only, what is the um, only Gen 5 Pokemon that doesn't learn a TM? Leave it in the comment section. I'd like to hear your answer without cheating. Um, if you enjoyed this video, please don't hesitate to leave a like on it either. A uh, quick little thing before I start. Um, my stream yesterday, I had to cancel it because I actually had a house fire, um, so it was pretty serious and I had to put it out myself. Um, it wasn't, it was obviously an accident and uh, I won't go into details, cause, but yeah, it was, it was pretty, it was pretty hairy scary, so I had to uh, sort of uh, can it straight away and just deal with that. So I do apologise for that and I am going to be doing another stream, not the weekend coming because I'm actually going on holidays this week to Calbarri, it's like a sort of like a, uh, a fishing sort of fishing camping sort of spot it's pretty cool actually I quite like fishing and um, but the following weekend I will make up for it for uh, with uh, at least a four hour stream for sure okay uh, I think that's everything I need to say let's get to the battle I apologize for that I just had to tell you guys what was uh, sort of happening in case you're wondering so a bit of a mixed tier um, from my opponent as well um, which I sort of relished I wanted to have a Go at some of those pokes. Okay, um, so I'm leading things off with my Staradia here. It's a bit of a... It's still got some nice stats as well, and uh, I mean, it's a far cry from St um, Staraptor, but it's still pretty um, viable. Okay, so I just went straight off the bat for a Brave Bird here. Um, I was praying for not Flame Body, and of course Flame Body kicks in, but I was happy I got the Volcarona out of the way anyway, and um, Banded Brave Bird does hurt like hell. Uh, so I take a lot from the recoil there, and I'm also damaged by the burn, so... I've got about one good more Brave Bird in me, then uh, that's pretty much I'm, I'm wasted there. So out comes another um, Flying type. So I thought, well, it may be Banded itself, because I was just thinking it would be Banded. Um, I know, I know see Bravery is Banded mostly. I, I mean, it can definitely, most certainly run Scarf as well. Um, but that's going to take me out of a rock slide. But that's okay. I was very happy with that result. And um, a Pokemon and... Um, Pokemon down and a half. So strange to Typhlosion, this thing is an absolute beast and, and you're not even going to lie about that. Uh, I can just use Eruption there to take it out um, quite easily. Um, so my team was... Uh, my team had some really, really Pokemon you'd never ever see. So I had to have a little bit of structure and backbone to this team just so things got really bad, which they most commonly do. And, um, yeah, I, I've also wanted to be trying out Gorgias for ages as well. Okay, obviously Earthquake was obvious there. Um, I'm just going to sponge that up easily with my awesome defense. Um, Gorgias for, for a grass type doesn't have sort of... It sort of lacks viable recovery outside of, like, rest and pain split. So it's a bit new for me to sort of use a grass type that doesn't sort of have that, uh, like, recovery. But I want to try it out a lot. Um, I'm just going to set up Leech Seeds because it's a great Leech Seeder as well. Um, I'm running a little bit different set. I normally would run will o -Lisp, but I'm sort of running... I couldn't really fit it on. I was sort of running a different uh, kind of set, um, like here. So um, I've got my seeds up anyway, um, which is good. Uh, he's going to withdraw because obviously that um, residual damage is going to uh, sort of wreck him. I just went for Pain Split here because I thought he may go for Foul Play or another Dark move. Excuse me. Um, but now comes the Porygon Z. Now, I was thinking... Well, it's, it's feeling a nice beam is coming my way. So I'm going to swap into my special defense tank, and I wanted to use Happiny for so long, and I don't give a fuck. I just wanted to use it. It was so awesome. Now, um, Happiny actually gets really tanky in special defense as well. It's great, and it's, it's quite fun to use. Um, it, it can just cannot take uh, a physical hit at all. Like, you just... Like, just an example, like a Greninja with, like, U-turn or something will do, like, three quarters to it. It's, it's just terrible in defense. 
Uh, so it can really, it's really quite hard to use because you have to really know their movesets. Uh, like mix attackers will completely destroy it. So it's uh, quite interesting to use it, but I want to try it out anyway. Okay, so we've got the uh, Agron here. Obviously going to be a Mega Agron. Um, I just want to protect it to sort of scope out what moves. Unfortunately, uh, they did the switch there, but uh, oh wells. Um, so into Pumpkin, again, to sort of tank out whatever there's going to be. I've, obviously, it's got Agronite, so I frisked that out. Now, um... I was thinking, well, this isn't too bad, but I really, I re once again, I really could have used Willow Is, so I am sort of thinking about putting it on this set. I did want to go a little bit more original with this set than just the obvious Willow Is, but it really sort of did need it. I got critted there, which sort of sucked. Um, like, I, I still did tank the hit. I know I'd be able to outspeed it just with my base speed, unless it was like a max speed Mega Agra. Um, I just went for the Pain Split there anyway. I thought it'd be best just going for that, getting a little bit more damage um, off than just going for like a Protect or something. Uh, he's going to hit me with Heavy Slam again. Nearly takes me out. I do tank that. Um, Gorgas has got some nice tanking abilities. And um, yeah, it's, it's, pr it's pretty handy uh, tanking all these um, hits in battle. So I just thought, well, I don't really have a check at all for this thing. So I'm, it, Apart from the Pokemon I'm using. So I just set up some seeds. And that's really all I can really do. Um, I'm going to aim for a revenge kill on this thing. Because I know it's special defense. Uh, it's a far cry from its defense. And even with Filter, I'm confident I can take it out. Okay, um, so into Typhlosion again. Yeah, so I can, once again, there's no rocks or anything up on the field, so I can just go for a full power uh, eruption there. And that is most certainly going to take aggro now, so uh, getting that threat out of the way was a uh, really good thing on my side of the field. Now, um, obviously I knew Crookedile was going to come in again, so since I'm Scarfed, obviously I can't stay into that. Um, earthquake or anything sort of is coming my way. Now, I don't really have much to tank at all, so I thought, well... The most disposable here is my Happiny. Um, this is quite funny. He uses foul play and it does like nothing because he's actually taken my attack, which is hilarious because I've got like one attack. Um, obviously, I just had to take the hit there, but um, Happiny did awesome there. I'm going to get some more use out of that for sure. Uh, unfortunately, he's got Moxie, so he's going to be really powerful in attack now. So, I thought about this move for a while. I thought, uh, let's just go for Focus Blast. I had to risk it because I had to get rid of this thing. It had a Moxie up. I land it, which is great. And that takes it out. I'm um, really, really happy to get rid of that. Now, the last two Pokemon in Rain were both weak to fighting. Uh, it's just, and I was locked into Focus Pass, so I thought, well, you know, I've got a, I'm even with a fighting chance, but even if I just, like, miss the next turn, it doesn't really matter. I got rid of the main thread. Uh, but I do hit again with Porygon Z, so that's great getting rid of that guy, too. I was very, very happy uh, about that. Now, the last poke here was Glaceon, so a couple of pokes weak to that, and I hit three Focus Blasts in a row, which was amazing, amazingly lucky, because I never really do that. Um, yeah, I, I openly admit that I was incredibly lucky getting rid of those last pokes, for sure. Uh, I'd say Porygon Z would have definitely taken me out, and I would have sort of had to start uh, with my Meowstic there, but I was confident I could get around uh, it, the rest of the team with Meowstic as well. Uh, I actually did have HP fighting for the Glaceon uh, as well, and as for the Porygon Z too, so I was sort of well prepared uh, if Focus Blast did uh, miss. And um, yeah, um, hopefully I'm going to try and get some more battles up uh, during my holiday if I can squeeze them in um, at night and stuff when I'm not doing fishing and stuff. I'll try and get some more videos up, as, as many as I can during this week. Uh, I do apologise if the uploads do are a little bit spaced out this week. Uh, I just uh, will try and get as many as possible as I can up. Um, also, yep, yeah, that question of the day. Um, if you did forget it, what is the only Gen 5 uh, Pokemon that doesn't learn a TM move? So, see if you can think about it. I, I had to think about this one for a while, and I only really knew it because I have looked at this Pokemon stats before. Um, and, and it's sorry, it's moves, and I, I did laugh. I laugh my ass off just because of the moves. Um, anyways, uh, as I said before, the stream will not be this weekend coming as well as I'm. I won't be back to the Sunday, uh, but like the day after and stuff. Yes, and uh, having that incident before with a freaking fire was a bit scary, so. Do apologise for that, but I will. I definitely will be getting back there uh, the week after. So, also, um, if you have any Pokemon you'd like me to use uh, on my next team, any suggestions? Excuse me, suggestion. I actually stuffed my tea down because I wanted to get um, some videos made before I go on holiday, so you guys can actually uh, have something to watch during the week. Um, I lost my train of thought. Sorry. 
If you have any uh, movesets or stuff you'd like me to use, or just try out, or just suggest, um, I'm happy to read through them. Um, I don't care what it is, like any moveset um, for any Pokemon, just put it out there. Preferably something that's not used too often. I do enjoy using those uh, sorts of Pokemon. Yeah, um, I think that's about everything. Um, but yeah, most of all, um, thanks for taking the time out of your day to watch my videos. Peace out, everyone.